Well, good afternoon. How often do we think about how much different life would be for us if we were back under the Old Testament law than what it is for us living under the dispensation of divine grace? This is Pastor Hayton and the Lord Likes Devotional, and I'd just kind of like to consider a few things about uh, the differences that we find uh, as Christians today than those who believe God in uh, the Old Testament. Now, back in the Old Testament, there were at least 600 rules or laws that the people were expected to keep, besides all of those that the religious leaders placed upon them. You see, not only were there the laws and the rules that God gave, but uh, the religious leaders, they uh, felt like it was so important to keep those laws that oftentimes they enacted what they called fences. Uh, laws or rules that would keep you a safe distance from breaking the actual law that God had given. So we know that uh, life under the Old Testament was laborious. We know that life under the Old Testament was constantly trying to uh, please God by, by doing uh, all that God had commanded them to do in the moral and the ceremonial law. But today... We Christians, we find that Christ really simplified things when he just gave us two rules. He first said, first of all, that we're to love the Lord thy God with all of our heart, with all of our mind, with all of our soul. Then he went on to give another rule, and that was that we are to love our neighbor as ourselves. And that's all we need to remember today. We don't have to remember all of the different things that pertain to uh, obedience to the Old Testament laws. I don't know how people could remember all of that myself. All we have to do is to remember that we're to love the Lord God with all of our heart. That is, he is to be first in all of our life. All the decisions that we make, all of the things that we partake of, all of the things that guide our life, he is to come first. And I think that if we will just put God first, we find that's just a pretty good way to live our life. So I know that Christ has said that we're to love the Lord thy God with all of our heart. He is to have first place in our life. And then love thy neighbor as thyself. What a good rule that is. If everybody loved their neighbor as they love themselves, uh, we wouldn't have to worry about telling lies about our neighbor. We wouldn't have to worry about coveting what they had. We wouldn't have to worry about uh, cheating them in any way. We wouldn't have to worry about uh, relationships because if everybody loved their neighbor as themselves, well, we'd all get along just pretty well, wouldn't we? We wouldn't have all of the discord. We wouldn't have all of the strife between people in different relationships and you know, when we get along with others, that enables us to get along with God. We've got to be able to have a good relationship with others in order to have a good relationship with God. So I know today that if we will love the Lord God with all of our heart, uh, that's commendable. And if we will love our neighbor as ourselves, well, that will enable us to get along well in life and all will be well and peaceful. Heavenly Father, help us to love one another and to love God with all of our heart. What a difference it makes in living the life that you want us to live. Now bless us throughout the day in Christ's name. Amen. Well, I'll see you tomorrow on Lord Light's Devotional here with Pastor Hayton. Goodbye now.